Hello, Scorpio. I'm getting ready to do your reading. Let's see what's going on for you, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. All right. Messages for Scorpio. You have changes coming. All right, pull two. Renewal and blessings are coming your way. Wow. So you have some good things coming in. Renewal, blessings. All right. Under the deck, Scorpio is receiving a message. So some form of communication is coming in. You're on the right path. Determination. Illuminations back there. Okay, good. So it looks like you're on the right path, Scorpio. You're headed in the right direction, whatever you're doing. All right, what does the guides want you to know at this time for Scorpio? Perfect timing. Okay, so that's a card of timing. So that means soon. What do the angel romance cards want you to know, Scorpio? Express your love. We also have keep an open mind and worth waiting for. So for some of you, this could definitely be a new person or the person you might be dealing with someone who is newer or been dating this person. And on the other hand, uh, this might be a reconciliation maybe for some with renewal, but under the deck, this say attraction. So it kind of feels like I get that card a lot of times when someone may be already noticing you and they're attracted to you. All right, we'll see. What is the overall energy for Scorpio? Hi, Priestess, listening to your intuition, or so is the other person. That's a good, I feel like you guys are drawn to each other with that card coming out as the overall energy, kind of like a knowing. They might be a water sign also. All right, how you are feeling, Scorpio, is the three of coins, and how this other person is feeling is the sun. Yeah, so I'm getting like attraction with that, drawn to you. Ace of Swords, Magician, and the Strength card. Could be a Leo. The Five of Cups, the Three of Cups, and the Death card. Okay, so definitely could be an end if there was a third party in this situation for some of you. Because Ace of Swords can be a renewal of a relationship and starting over possibly. Or somebody speaking their truth. What is the Sun? Yeah, this is somebody who like is happy that you're in their life or you're back in their life, Scorpio. Like they didn't want to admit that without you they were lonely or sad or out in the cold. Hey, okay, why is this all happening? Why is this all happening? Three of Wands, okay. Well, it has something possibly to do with money or work. Okay, we have the sun and the eight of coins under here. World, ace of wands. This could be either somebody you worked with, or this could actually be a work reading for some of you, or maybe a mix of both. Because the three of coins can be working together. Now this might be someone also who... Definitely could be someone who is in another relationship, and it could have been you because it's on your side, Scorpio, but if you're out of that relationship, if that is over, it's like this person can't wait to see you again, to talk to you again, to be with you. It could be a past crush or something. That could be the renewal. It could be that you guys weren't together before because of other people being in the picture. This person missed you a lot. Now, again, I'm kind of thinking for some of you this has to do with money or work or some type of situation. I'm also getting, um, I'm getting that, I'm seeing, they're showing me a, um, what do you call it, uh, not a pound. We don't call them pounds. I mean, I have so many rescues. What is it called? A rescue, I guess. I'm seeing someone volunteer. I'm seeing like the building with the, the chain link like, fences with the dogs. Um, so I don't know if you volunteer somewhere or you go someplace like that. Or maybe it's a dog park. But that really wasn't look like. Anyways, it could be school. But I know school's not in right now. But it looks like work. It looks like somewhere where you worked around this person or you helped. It wasn't, you know, like a volunteer situation or something with the three of coins. This is showing this person really was attracted to you again, or they're attracted to you now. You can still be talking to this person now. I don't, I don't know why I always make it like it's a past person coming back. They could be here now uh, wanting to tell you how they feel. Because you're getting communication and they want you to keep an open mind, express how you're feeling. And this person really, this, this is worth waiting for the two of you being together, communicating again, talking. Um, so I'm getting actually this three of wands, 10 of coins, page of wands could be communication about, they want you to come work with them again, or, you know, come see the family, come visit. Cause on the other 10 of coins, there's, you know, all the people sitting on there. 
So it could be about more, you know, other things, traveling, family, friends, groups of people, money. It's kind of what I'm seeing here. So there's an invitation is kind of what I'm getting because I think that's the message. So some of you, you may be coming back together with family, friends, you know, an ex. Um, I don't get it specifically an ex, so I'll be honest, but it could be. But um, again, for some of you, the Three of Cups could be going out and dating or drinking or just having fun. It doesn't have to be a third party, but whatever it was, that, that situation was over. It almost looks like at one time, maybe for some, maybe there was a sleeping together here, but then this is my not sleeping together, but there's a third person in the picture also. So that might make sense to some of you where it was at one time a passionate relationship, but then it, it had to end. You're going to enjoy whatever you're doing because I feel like this is this situation person how is coming back around with the sun and the eight of coins. They're showing it as work, but for it can't be the same, you know, it could be other things. Page of Cups, Ace of Wands, a new beginning or a new, I should say, cycle here starting where you're really happy. Yeah, I feel like yeah, some situation wasn't working or it was just it was over or it could have been because of COVID-19, obviously. Probably the main thing. You're on the right path. Okay. How do you feel about this person, Scorpio? How do you view this person? What do you think of this person? You see that it's maybe very generous or balanced. I'm getting more generosity because there's a lot of coins here. Because see how he's holding on his coins and now he's feeling empty or cold and he or she does not want to feel this way. They don't want to acknowledge it. I'm getting this is this is them when they give. This is when them they enjoy being with you or taking you out or seeing you. How do this is how you view them? And how do they view you? Two of swords. So yeah, it was kind of like there was a relationship happening or there's flirting right here, but then it ended suddenly and like you were protecting your heart. Maybe you were already in a relationship or they were or something possibly. What is the six of coins? How you view this person, Scorpio? Hanged man, the sun, and the page of cups. There was definitely, there's a, definitely a strong attraction between the two of you, that's for sure. And you really, not just that, it's just you guys like each other. You, you're happy when you're with them. They're fun. They view you as the two of swords, though. So ace of wands, six of coins on your side, and the fool. So again, generosity, fun, passion, um, giving. They see you the same way as, as giving with the six of coins. You guys must have a nice balance here. You both give and take the same. Wow, six of coins on both sides. You don't see that very often, but you really like this person. It may have been that you did start falling in love with them, but the timing was not right. Because perfect timing tells me it's the right time. So I'm assuming that's now. Like the perfect timing is now. What is the possible or potential outcome? Or advice. Sometimes this is also advice. The seven of coins, it is in reverse. Interesting, because that's in the reverse. So this is about not looking at the past not like overthinking it not because something had happened here in the past and if you were to be looking at it you probably wouldn't give this another chance but this is like you know what I'm just gonna let the past go what does this mean with the seven of coins in reverse hermit ten of wands ten of swords wow seven of wands blocking so the wheel of fortune is under the deck with this but that is that's heavy energy so might be a virgo but we got two major tens here and seven of wands blocking the situation. So again, I feel like this is more advice than the outcome because I'm seeing the cards we pulled are really good. So the advice is the old cycle is over. Cause remember we had the world. So whatever the situation is, the old, the past is done. It's over with the new is starting with this person situation. And it's about not letting, you know, the past, whatever's happened, interfere with the future or the present. Might be a Virgo, but I think someone did some soul searching or did you know a lot of thinking there. What is the strength card with this situation? Four of Wands, the world again, and the lovers. Wow, Five of Swords. Yeah, somebody wants to speak their mind. They want to tell you how they feel, Scorpio, because that is obviously being together, a new cycle, and lovers. I feel like it feels like a lot of passion from this person, and they're kind of holding back. But now it's obviously better timing for this situation. What can we know about this person, good or bad? What can we know about this person? We have, they have an adventurous spirit. They're very sincere. And in the near future, wow, and under the deck it says soulmate, Scorpio. Wow. All 
right, anything else we need to know about this situation? I'm going to pick that one off. So you're on the right path. So again, I feel like you don't really have to do anything, Scorpio. Some of you are already talking to this person. You're around them. You know who they are. You guys are kind of like, I feel like some of you are trying to hold back from one another, but it's something here is changing. Again, they may be getting a divorce or ending a relationship, or you are. Because again, this is not wanting to invest in something anymore, right? So waiting for it, investing in it, and this is like, nope. I'm done. I'm done putting my time and attention into the situation. It is over. I've thought about it. I'm good. I'm blocking it. I'm over it. So again, it could be another person they're dealing with. What else do we need to know about this situation? One more. You left quite an impression. What else? Secret. Oh, I like that. One more, Scorpio. Meeting someone new. I feel like you already met this person. And one more. Hang on, one more. Intimacy. Okay, so passion. All right. All right, so again, for some of you, this might be someone brand new who you have not met. And, um, but, so I'm going to leave it there, Scorpio. Have a really good week, and I'll talk to you soon.